Today, our nation faces a new peril, not from a foreign power or economic crisis, but from our own lack of good physical conditioning. Just how serious is this peril? And what can the citizens in Illinois and in your community do to stop it? Well, let's find out from our very special Community Health Week guest right now on Medical Interview. Hello, this is Bill Anderson for the Illinois State Medical Society, your host on Medical Interview. Our guest today is none other than baseball great Stan Musial, current chairman of the President's Physical Fitness Council and honorary chairman for Community Health Week in Illinois. Well, Mr. Musial, being so active in the nation's physical fitness program, I wonder if you'd tell us just how serious this problem of physical fitness is in America. Well, Bill, I'm afraid it's uh, really uh, quite serious. And as uh, former President Kennedy put it, and President Johnson has really affirmed it, we have uh, become a nation of spectators. Uh, this fact is very painfully evidenced by recent test results that show our boys and girls rank far below the children of Japan, uh, England, and Western Europe in strength and endurance. Our children are the leaders of tomorrow, and if our nation is to remain strong, they must be strong and fit. Well, Mr. Musial, don't our... Um don't our schools provide adequate athletic programs to keep these children fit? Uh, they sure do, Bill, but uh, unfortunately only a small percentage of our school youngsters participate actively in athletics. Uh, one reason for the President's Council on Physical Fitness is to start physical education programs for all children in school. Well, has much progress uh, been made in this area, Mr. Museum? Yes, there has. Uh, in the last three years, we had a 12% increase in the number of children uh, participating in school fitness programs and 13 states have strengthened their school physical education requirements. Well, you know, as one of baseball's very all-time greats, I wonder if you'd tell us just how important phys physical fitness was uh, to your career. I blew it, let me do it. Uh, Mr. Musial, as one of baseball's very all-time greats, I wonder if you'd tell us just how important physical fitness was to your career. Bill, I think I can illustrate this best with an example. Uh, perhaps you can remember my 3,000 hit of my Major League career. I sure do. And it was made right here in Illinois against the Cubs uh, at Wrigley Field uh, back in 1958. And, of course, at that time I was 37 years old, an old man by baseball <laughs> standards, and uh, I doubt if I could have made that hit or continue active uh, playing for five more years with the Co uh, coordination and endurance uh, developed through a regular routine of physical exercise. And I like to emphasize that, that the physical fitness is uh, not only important to athletes, but to everyone who wants to look and feel and do his uh, very best. Well, I've heard so very much about these benefits of physical exercise. Mr. Musial, specifically, just what are they? First of all, uh, it uh, really improves uh, muscle tone. It also increases the efficiency of the heart and keeps the joints flexible. It improves uh, posture, uh, fights fatigue and tension, and aids uh, weight control. Well, how do you think, uh, Mr. Musial, the citizens of Illinois can stay and keep physically fit? I think certainly one of the easiest uh, ways to participate in the statewide campaign is to promote uh, physical fitness. And it will could be. Could we, excuse me, that is uh, uh, a flood, Mr. Musial. Could, could you do that one once over? One of the easiest ways is to participate in the state. Oh, I see. Campaign. All right. What did I say? Okay, okay, go ahead. Do you want to? Uh, certainly, one of the easiest ways is to participate in the statewide campaign to promote physical fitness. It will be launched during Community Health Week, October 18th through the 24th. The Illinois State Medical Society has asked me to be an honorary chairman for the Community Health Week in Illinois this year, and I am honored to accept. In this capacity, I urge Illinois citizens of all ages to help make Community Health Week Physical Fitness Week in their local communities. A good way is to start to, inde a good way is to, start to investigate and use the playground and outdoor recreational facilities available in your communities. Also find out if the physical education programs in your schools are really adequate to keep your children in top physical condition. And above all, take 15 minutes a day for a regular program of physical exercise. Descriptive, descriptive brochures on adult and children's exercise 
are available from the Illinois State Medical Society, 360 North Michigan Avenue, Chicago, or from the President's Council on Physical Fitness, Washington 25, D.C. Well, thank you. Thank you very much, Mr. Musial. Our guest today has been baseball great Stan Musial, Chairman of the President's Council on Physical Fitness and Honorary Chairman for Community Health Week in Illinois. Medical Interview has been brought to you by the Illinois State Medical Society as a public service feature in cooperation with this station. Thank you very much. It was fine, Mr. Musial. Yeah, now, the rest of this, this is... Uh, um, let's see, here are the one-minute scripts, and you have a... Okay, you have that. Let me see. And the four, oh, the four-minute. Okay, you're fine. You're set with what you have. Perhaps you want to read the four-minute message next. That's this the, one here? That's the rough one. And then. All right. <clears throat> Whenever you're ready. <clears throat> all right. Go. It's all yours. Right. <laughs> Hello, doctor. Uh, this is Stan Musial. I could... Just once more, this this is the one that's got to be kind of smooth just for the intro of the rest I of see. The Hello, uh, Doctor, this is Stan Musial. Once more, just, hello, Doctor. Oh, this I is see. Stan Musial. <laughs> <laughs> you know, hello, Doctor. Uh, <laughs> Anytime, go ahead. Hello, Doctor. Hello, Doctor. This is Stan Musial. Have you ever seen a bases loaded home run win a game in the last half of the ninth? Or witness a perfect no hitter? You can be sure that the athletes who turn in these top flight performances have one thing in common physical fitness. As a ball player in the National League for 23 years, I know firsthand how important physical fitness is to top performance. Perhaps you remember the 3,000 hit of my major league career. It was made right here in Illinois against the Chicago Cubs at Wrigley Field during the 1958 season. Could you get go back on that All sentence? Right. It was made right here in Illinois. All right. It was made right here in Illinois against the Chicago Cubs at Wrigley Field uh, during the 1958 season. At that, ta at that time, I was 37 years old, an old man by baseball standards. But I don't believe that I could make that hit or continue my active playing career for another five years without the coordination and endurance developed through a regular daily routine of physical exercise. As a physician, you know that exercise is not only important to ball players, but to everyone who wants to look, feel, and do his best. And of course, you know that exercise improves muscle tone, increases the efficiency of the heart, uh, fights fatigue and tension, improves posture, aids weight control, and helps to maintain mental alertness. Unfortunately, many Americans neglect the vital task of keeping fit. And as, President, and as former President Kennedy put it, and President Johnson reaffirms this, we are becoming a nation of spectators. The results of this uh, neglect... The results of this neglect. Neglect. <laughs> neglect. <laughs> the results of this neglect. <laughs> the results of this neglect can be d disastrous because a nation is only as strong and vigorous as its citizens. The results of this neglect can be disastrous because a nation is only as strong and vigorous as its citizens. Keeping America fit has been the sole purpose of the President's Physical Fitness Council since its formation back in 1961. I am honored to be the present uh, chairman of this council and equally honored that your state medical society has asked me to serve as honorary chairman for Community Health Week in your state for 1964. Community Health Week, Community Health Week will be observed, observed nationally from October 18th through the 24th of this year. In Illinois, it will be celebrated with an all-out campaign. To do that. In Illinois, it will be celebrated with an all-out campaign to encourage. Once more, all-out. <laughs> all-out. <laughs> in Illinois, it will be celebrated with an all-out. 
In Illinois, it will be celebrated with an all-out campaign to encourage and promote physical fitness in your local communities. There will be special radio and telev television messages. There will be special radio and television messages. Pamphlet literature distributed in drugstores and doctor's offices. Newspaper ads. School com competitions. And even outdoor billboards encouraging Illinois citizens of all ages to get on the health team with a regular program of exercise. Maybe I should read okay, that. fine. I think the, yeah, the... Um, let me do this. Let those, me do sure, this okay, another. there will be. <clears throat> There will be special radio and television messages, pamphlet literature, uh, distributed in drugstores and doctor's offices. There will be newspaper ads and school competitions, and even outdoor billboards encouraging Illinois citizens of all ages to get on the health team with a regular program of exercise. The Illinois State Medical Society is one of the first medical organizations to take the lead in promoting physical fitness to the public. In your local community, citizens will look to you personally for leadership in this. In your local community, citizens will look to you personally for leadership in this pioneer undertaking. How can you provide this leadership? First of all, become familiar with exercises worked out by the President's Physical Fitness Council. They're easy to do and lots of fun. Descriptive, descriptive pamphlets are available in quantity along with a colorful pamphlet rack for your office. Descriptive pamphlets are available in the... Descriptive... <laughs> That's a bad... Say, just say pamphlets. Pamphlets. Sure. <laughs> Brochures, anything. Pamphlets are available in quantity along with a colorful pamphlet rack for your office simply by writing to your Illinois State Medical Society. Pamphlets are available in quantity along with a colorful pamphlet rack for your office simply by writing to your Illinois State Medical Society, 360 North Michigan Avenue, Chicago 1, Illinois. Your partner in health, the local pharmacist, will welcome the opportunity to display this rack on his counter. Your partner in health, the local pharmacist, will welcome the opportunity to display this rack on his counter. So why not order an extra one for him? Recommend these exercises to all of your patients whose condition can be helped with a regular routine of physical activity. Recommend these exercises to all your patients whose condition can be helped with a regular routine of physical activity. I'll keep on going. Uh also find out what playground or supervised recreational activities are available to the citizens of your community. Also find out what playground or supervised recreation activities are available to the citizens of your community and which one you could recommend. Remember that the focal point of this program is our youngsters and leaders of tomorrow. Okay, that one will Well, let me uh, read this over again. Okay. Also find out what playground or supervised recreation activities are available to the citizens of your community and which you could recommend. Remember that the focal point of this program is our youngsters, the leaders of tomorrow. Encourage them to participate in athletics or in a physical fitness program offered in your schools. Offer to, <clears throat> offer to speak on the subjects of health and exercise at school assemblies and parent-teachers meetings. Above all, I hope that you will set the pace by setting a good example. Reserve 50 minutes of your daily schedule for a healthful workout. By making Community Health Week Physical Fitness Week throughout Illinois this year, you are taking a giant step toward you are taking a giant step step forward in achieving better health for the citizens of your community. I'll make this. By making Community Health Week Physical Fitness Week throughout Illinois this year, you are taking a giant step forward in achieving better health for the citizens of your community. In addition, you are setting a national example which eventually will lead to a healthier, stronger America. Think that'll do it? I think so. Okay, that's fine. Let's hold up for a few minutes. Okay, let's take a take breather. A for a few minutes. <laughs> <laughs> 
This is Stan Musial, Honorary Chairman for Community Health Week in Illinois. Baseball's greatest hitters all had their own batting styles, but you can be sure of one thing they had in common, physical fitness. It's important to realize that physical fitness is not only important to ball players, but to everyone who wants to look, feel, and do his best. That's why the physicians of Illinois has designated that's why the physicians of Illinois have des designated have made maybe a, if you want to let me try it again. That's why the physicians of Illinois have designated Community Health Week October 18th through the 24th as physical fitness week for local communities throughout the state. How can you participate? Simply by exploring and using their physique simply by exploring and using the physical education and recreational facilities in your community. Also by setting aside 15 minutes a day for a regular program of physical exercise. Descriptive pamphlets on both adult and children's exercises are available from your Illinois State Medical Society, 360 North Michigan Avenue, Chicago, or the President's Council of Physical Fitness of Washington 25, D.C. Remember, your community is only as strong as its citizens. Keep it strong by keeping fit. That's Think that, fine, Mr. Muriel. That that, that's good. very good. That's real fine. Z. Whoops, I forgot honorary in that one. <laughs> Maybe you better put it because I guess our Dr. Isley is chairman for community health. We can help. <laughs> I don't want to put you out of a job, doctor. I know you love this, <laughs> especially sweating out our time skip. Okay. Anytime you're ready, Mr. Musial. This is Stan Musial, honorary chairman for Community Health Week in Illinois. In baseball, three strikes and you're out. In real life, many of our children already have two strikes against them. They rank far below the children of Japan, England, and Western Europe in endurance and strength. This tragic weight... I think... You, do you mind doing that sentence? Right. Or, thank you. In real life, many of our children already have two strikes against them. They rank far below the children of Japan, England, and Western Europe in strength and endurance. This tragic waste of human resources possesses a threat to our, our strength as individuals. This tragic waste of human resources poses a threat to our... <laughs> That's a bad one. Is a, maybe right. is a threat, huh? This tragic waste of human resources poses a threat to our strength as individuals. This tragic waste of human resources poses a threat to our strength as individuals and as a nation. To, to resolve this problem, the phys... Hold it, time, time, time. <laughs> Let me start all over. Whatever you like. All right. <clears throat> this is Stan Muse, the Honorary Chairman for Community Health Week in Illinois. In baseball, three strikes and you're out. In real life, and many of our children already have two strikes against them. They rank far below the children of Japan England and Western Europe in strength and endurance. This tragic waste of human resources poses a threat to our strength as, as individuals and as a nation. To resolve this problem, the physicians of Illinois are encouraging citizens of all ages to participate in a regular program of exercise. It's easy and it's fun. Descriptive pamphlets are available from your local from your Illinois State Medical Society, 360 North, Ad North Michigan Avenue. Descriptive pamphlets are available for your time. <laughs> Make it pamphlets. That's a bad one anyway. Descriptive pamphlets. That's too much. Just right. pamphlets. Pamphlets. <clears throat> pamphlets, are, pamphlets are available from your Illinois State Medical Society, 360 North Michigan Avenue, Chicago or the President's Council on Physical Fitness, Washington, D.C., 25. During Community Health Week, October 18th through the 24th, there will be an all-out campaign to encourage physical fitness in your community. I am honored to be able to join with the physicians of your community in urging you to participate in this campaign by helping to make Community Health Week Physical Fitness Week throughout Illinois. You will take a giant step forward in keeping your community 
and your nation strong. Fine. That's right. I think we can work, work it in Once you got get started on this, you can get a new chavy being an announcer here. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Buy the station and the... <laughs> Okay. Is he still on? He's on. We're just keeping right. on rolling. Anytime right. you're ready. <coughs> this is Stan Musial, Honorary Chairman for Community Health Week in Illinois. Do you remember the 3,000 hit of my Major League career? I made it right here in Illinois against the Chicago Cubs. I could not made that hit or continued active playing career for 23 years. I could not made that hit or continued an active playing career for 23 years. I could not have made. <clears throat> just right. I could not have made that hit or continued an active playing career for 23 years. Couldn't? I could not have made that hit or continued an active playing career for 23 years without the coordination and endurance developed through regular exercise. Unfortunately, far too many children and adults don't get the exercise they need to enjoy the best of health. For this reason, the physicians of Illinois have started a, a physical fitness campaign to encourage you and your local communities. Oh, I, I'm sorry, that, because that's an edited one that's bad. For this reason, the physicians in Illinois are starting an all-out campaign, or whatever you have, uh, they're starting a campaign to encourage physical fitness For in your local reason, community. For this reason, the physicians of Illinois are, are, are starting, starting to... a campaign to encourage physical fitness. Oh, I see. Physical that. fitness comes after the encourage. I'll take that one real slow, I'm sorry, it's hard. Unfortunately, far too many children and adults don't get the exercise they need to enjoy the best of health. For this reason, the physicians in Illinois are starting a campaign to encourage physical fitness in your local communities. This campaign will be launched during Community Health Week, October 18th through the 24th. You can participate simply by taking advantage of the physical recreation facilities in your community and by reserving 15 minutes a day for a regular routine of physical exercise. Descriptive pamphlets are available for your, from your... Pamphlets. Pamphlets are available from your Illinois State Medical Society, 360 North Michigan, Chicago, or the President's Council on Physical Fitness, Washington 25, D.C. To look and feel and do your best, get on the health team with the physical fitness. I'm gonna do that last yeah. time. To look, feel, and do your best, Get on the health team with physical fitness. Good. <clears throat> this is Stan Musial, Honorary Chairman for Community Health Week in Illinois. In baseball, curve balls are always hard to hit. Today, unfortunately, many Americans are being a cur Today, unfortunately, many Americans are being thrown a curve from their own lack of physical fitness. Without a regular routine of physical activity, you cannot look and feel and do your best. That's why the physicians of, uh, that's why the physicians of Illinois are starting an all-out campaign to encourage physical fitness for all citizens in your community. It will be launched during Community Health Week. October 18th through the 24th. The success of this campaign depends on your active participation. First of all, investigate and use the recreational facilities available in your community. Also find out if your Also find out if physical education programs in local schools are adequate for your children. And above all, Reserve 15 minutes a day for the regular routine of physical exercise. Above all, reserve 15 minutes a day for a regular routine of physical exercise. Help to keep your nation strong by keeping yourself and your family physically fit. I think that was all right. That was fine. That was good. Was it, Doctor? Excellent. Very good. You're getting better and better. Last, down to the last wire, huh? Last inning.
Now, I before you even start this, I uh, made a grammatical error here, uh, Mr. Musial. Excuse me, may I borrow this? This doesn't make sense, Dr. Isley pointed out to me. Today our nation faces a similar danger brought on by our own lack of good physical conditioning. I'm sorry, uh -huh. this makes it hard to read, but... Yeah, let's try it. <clears throat> <clears throat> this is Stan Musial, honorary chairman for Community Health Week in Illinois. A power hitter at the plate with the bases loaded always represents a dangerous situation in baseball. Today, our nation faces a similar... Today, our nation faces a similar... <laughs> <laughs> a similar danger. <laughs> similar, similar, similar. Today, our nation faces a similar danger. This is Stan Musial, honorary chairman for Community Health Week in Illinois. A power hitter at the plate with the bases loaded always represents a dangerous situation in baseball. Today, our nation faces a similar danger but by our own lack of good physical conditioning. Uh, okay, can we do that once more today? Our nation right. faces a similar danger brought on. <clears throat> today our nation faces a sim similar danger. Today our nation faces a similar danger brought on by our own lack of good physical conditioning. As President, as former President Kennedy has put it, and President Johnson reaffirms this, we are becoming a nation of spectators. As Fred... Just re repeat, yeah. we are becoming a nation of spectators and we'll, yeah. we'll slice it. All right, let me try again. Okay. As former President Kennedy put it, and President Johnson reaffirms it, we are becoming a nation of spectators. What can you do to what can you do to keep our nation fit and strong? What can you do to keep our nation fit and strong? One important step is What can you do to keep our nation fit and strong? One important step is to join the physicians of Illinois in an all out campaign to encourage physical fitness in your local community. This campaign will be launched during Community Health Week, October 18th through the 24th. During that time, you are urged to become a, During that time, you are urged to become acquainted with the During that time, you are urged to become acquainted with the playground and other recreational facilities available in your community. Also, find out if the physician also find out if the physical ed education it's coming to the it's a end. Rough combination. <laughs> no, that's right. I get it. <laughs> I got ten more for you after this. Also, find out if the physical education programs in your schools are adequate to keep your children in top physical condition. Finally, make a routine. Finally, make a regular routine of daily exercise. Finally make a root finally make a regular routine of daily exercise. To help you, pamphlets can be obtained from the Illinois State Medical Society or the President Council on Physical Fitness, Washington 25 DC. To help keep your nation strong, help make Community Health Week Physical Fitness Week in your community this year. To help keep your nation strong, help make Community Health Week Physical Fitness Week in your community this year. I think that's it. That is it. I can't thank you enough. Uh, this will.